What's up guys? Welcome back to the Beta TV studio for another live episode of Beta Insider. I'm your host, Noel. So glad that you've tuned in today because we've got a great episode in store. We are talking to Amit Shalev, who is the VP of Business Development at Nexar. Now, Nexar created the world's smartish smartest dash cams uh, with its own software and cameras, and they've really thought of everything here from AI capabilities to app integration to features like their parking mode, which keeps your car protected even when you're not on the road. I'm super excited to learn alongside you guys more about Nexar from Amit, so let's bring him into the conversation, joining us live from New York City. Hey Amit, how's it going? Hello, it's going well, (laughs) thank you. Good. Good, so glad that you're uh, joining us here today to help us learn more about Nexar. Now, to start off with me, I'm curious, what problem in the, in the market um, did Nexar initially set out to solve? Well, there's basically a big kind of lack of proof problem when I'm driving on the road and involved in an accident. Mm-hmm. Um, accidents are a bummer. And unfortunately, they happen to us. Um, And having that extra set of eyes on the road is extremely, extremely helpful. And we wanted to streamline, make it super easy for our users to be able to report accidents uh, and and essentially, you know, have help another set of of eyes of, you know, helping out when um, you're in distress, when you're in a collision, you don't want to start fiddling with anything you want peace of mind you want to make sure that that video is there it's saved it's in the cloud it's on your phone you can show it to a police officer you can show it to insurance you can show it to the other person uh that quite kind of quiets them down really quickly and so really ease of use out of a category of, of dash cameras was something that we saw was incredibly important mm-hmm yeah, and obviously, I mean, um, you know, having that video insurance, like you said, is so important. It's becoming much more prevalent now. Um, okay. So, so there are, are, of course, other, you know, uh, dash cams out on the yeah. market. What is the Nexar advantage? It's the app. Uh, we have an amazing team that has built an amazing app that has a ton of features. Um, so you go, you buy a dash cam, pretty economic, really good dash cam too. But the cool part is really the app that is just evolving over time. Um, many features. So for example, talking about parking mode feature, right? Um, you parked your car somewhere outside, um, you went home for the night, you came back to the vehicle, you saw someone sideswiped it. Uh, it's a bummer. And you know, they didn't write that note saying they were sorry. Uh, how many times does that happen? Um, but with Nexar, you just have the proof, right? Uh, you get in the car, you get an alert immediately to your phone that there was an incident at night, and you can actually see the video of what happened, get the license plate of the person that had sideswiped you, hit your car, and now you have evidence, which is great. And that's something very cool we introduced to the app. Um, you know, the camera itself is super easy to install. So it takes a few minutes. Uh, you connect it to your USB uh, port, you download the app, you pair it one time, and you know, you're know you protected. Um, so yeah, the app itself is helpful in many other ways. I mean, we have a bunch of other really cool things. It's really easy to upload a video to the cloud. It's really easy to upload a video to YouTube, send it to your friends on WhatsApp or Facebook. You don't have to fill with the SD card. Uh, that's a bummer mm-hmm. a lot of times. A lot of times these SD cards are not very good. Uh, so everything is recorded uh, to your phone as well. And if something happens, um, like a collision, uh, we upload that to the cloud immediately and in real time. And you don't have to deal with any of that. And you can have access to that um, you know, through the app itself and through our portal. Um, and we're, we're always evolving the app. Right. So we've added a groups feature. Uh, so essentially you can add people to your group. Uh, if you have a family, most people do it with families. Uh, and in case you are not involved in any type of collision, your family is going to receive a text message with a video and with a call to action to call the first responders. So protection, wow. protection, protection. Yeah. That, that is 
Amazing. Um, Maybe. and of course I, it resonates with me, you know, you're talking about, um, things happening when you're, you know, when you're parked living in San Francisco, um, yeah. there's a lot of people and not a lot of space and yeah. it is hard to have a car here in this city. Um, yeah. I've seen so many cars with dings and, you know, so it, I just think it's so nice that, that Nexar is like constantly, it's like you said, it's a second pair of eyes. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's extremely helpful, especially in big cities, especially places with with high crime. Uh, I live in San Francisco yeah. and now live in New York. We see break-ins all the time. And, right. you know, even having a camera is a deterrent, to be perfectly honest. Uh, it's a great thing to have. Yeah, that, that's a great point. And I love the sharing capabilities. I've used the app. I've used, um, I just want to point out really quickly, I've got two of the cameras yeah. here. So we have the Beam here, um, which I've, I've used. And then we have the Pro, which I'm really excited to use. Um, and we'll yeah. talk a little bit about the differences in just a second. But I was amazed at the sharing capabilities. Um, you know, not only if something, like you're saying, if, if you're in a, an, an accident, you can alert your loved ones. Or you can also... Um, I think, right, you can uh, alert your insurance company as yeah. well or create a report. Absolutely. Uh, if you are involved in any kind of accident, um, not only is it automatically detected, but within one click, you can actually send a report in a PDF format to your insurance company, to your broker, oh my gosh. Uh, to your friends and family. And that includes the video, the location, how hard you were hit, where you were wow. hit. It's a really nice automated report that has really, you know, that enables the person who needs to be looking at this accident to understand exactly what happened. Uh, you know, like we say, like the proof is in the pudding and you have to have that tool that helps you bring out the proof. Um, so we've seen endless amounts of very happy customers who, uh, who unfortunately were involved in accidents, but luckily had um, our collision insights and the ability to understand what happened during the collision. Again, like a lot of times, I don't know if you were involved in accidents, but I was, and, and you're just kind of dazed and stunned. And you oh don't want to yes. deal with anything. And you don't want to remember three weeks later, you're talking to your insurance company, what happened? Who hit you? Did you hit the other guy? What was their license plate? Were there people around? Get their numbers. And, and you know, this is just like, you have it, you know? Right. Right, it does it all for you. Captures uh, everything that goes uh, that, that happens in that moment, um, yeah. and you're so right. And and I mean, you know, it can be really, um, it can be so so jarring. And then of course, you don't know who the other person is that you hit. You don't know what they're gonna claim, yeah. how they're gonna spin things. Yeah. Um, yeah. So yeah. so I mean, Nexar just captures like you're saying everything. Now on a lighter note too, I was, um, I was watching some of the marketing materials and I, I noticed that, uh, you know, Nexar will also capture like funny moments on the road oh, yeah. that, oh, that yeah. you can, you can clip that in the app and you can share that. So if anyone out there is like trying to go viral, right. With these funny it's, moments, it's <laughs> uh, listen, like how many times do you like catch yourself and see some weird stuff that's happening <laughs> on the road and say, Oh, if, if I just, I could just record. I can say Siri record the moment and Siri wow. is going to record a video clip of what you just saw 20 seconds before and 20 seconds after. So you don't miss a beat and we get some wacky things and people upload them to our social networks and, and you know, tag us and you see a bunch of animals. You see, you know, in Christmas time, we did a bunch of Santa Clauses. It, it's very nice. So. You know, we also see the majority of our users uploading videos that, you know, are just for fun. Um, mm -hmm. So, you know, with everything now being recorded and people, yeah, like you said, wanting to go viral, uploading their videos, like the road is definitely a content creator um, <laughs> and, and we see it a lot. Yeah, it's very cool. Definitely. And, and for people out there, right, I know there's obviously some people probably that, uh, that don't currently uh, use a dash cam. I think we've you know, um, more or less convince them, right? But that they need to have a Nexar dash cam because it's going to uh, really just add that extra layer of insurance. For anyone out there that already does have a dash cam, why should they upgrade to Nexar? The app, the app is yeah. ever evolving. I mean, we're the number one dash cam brand in the US and for a reason. 
Uh, if you go to Apple, if you go to Google Play Store, like you're going to see the ratings on our app are you know, four and a half, four point six sky high. And when you look at kind of the others, uh, you could you could significantly tell the difference. Uh, so the app is extremely helpful and it's ever evolving. And you know there are a lot of cameras out there and they can record stuff. It's just like you want to know that you can rely on something and. Mm -hmm. I think the app makes that connection very, very well. Yeah, and I want to draw attention to the fact too that uh, the cloud has unlimited storage, and it's constantly—it's this constant stream from the camera to your phone. So you don't yeah. have to worry about keeping things organized, or you know, it's you know, it all it happened be to me. It happened to me. So I was driving in California, uh, and I had made a stop at a stop sign. Uh, and uh -huh. then continued, and obviously um, I had an XR running, uh, and I was stopped by a police officer. Uh, and the police officer told me that I did not stop at the stop sign. Um, and I said that I did, and I thought that the police officer was mistaken, and they were at him. They were not mistaken. I had pulled out my phone. Uh, the proof is in the pudding. It's in the palm of my hand. I pulled out the phone, and I showed the last 10 minutes. It was a few minutes ago. I showed the video and it showed me stopping and that was that and I was like exonerated on the spot and you hear this wow. happening all the time all the time it's it's hilarious you just have like the past of you know whatever minutes that you drove in your phone and you know it's on the spot and accessible to you immediately so not only is it in the SD card not only is it on the phone if we do detect that you are involved in something serious like an accident it's also uploaded to the cloud. And like you mentioned, unlimited data on the cloud. So, yeah. you know, I, I, I hope you're not involved in many accidents and you don't do a lot of hard breaks all the time. But if you are, it's always there in the cloud. And if some person calls you two months later saying that, you know, during the collision, actually, it was your fault, not their fault, like they said initially, you can always pull that video from the cloud. Right. Yeah. Um, well, very happy to hear that you weren't ticketed. Uh, in that <laughs> instance, yeah, in that instance. <laughs> you got away clean, um, thanks to yeah. Nexar. Um, what about some other customer feedback or anecdotes that you guys have heard uh, from Nexar users? There, there's probably so many. <laughs> there's a ton. There's a few that, that come up. We had one pretty recently, uh, Will, William Rivers. Um, it's what we talked about earlier. So he had the pro model. And, and Okay, you great. The differences yet. This one. Nah, the other one. The other... <laughs> no, no, oh, no, this no. one. This one. Excuse me. This one. This is the pro. This is the B. It's all good. It's all good. The pro has also an internal camera. So it's internal and external. And okay. you, can, you can see a collision happening to, 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 to William. And you can see it inside and outside. And it's pretty jarring. And it, it, it really is that effect of getting hit and getting stunned. And we mm. see a lot of outside view, but this one had also inside view and you see the people in, in their state of mind. And he was so lucky that he had the dash camera um, because it exonerated him. It saved it. Like we, wow. so we tell that story a bunch of times, you know, a lot of times, but this one, you could also see their faces internally. And it was him and, and one of his employees, and it was pretty horrific. And they acted like stand up people, which was also really amazing to see, making sure they're okay, making sure the other person was okay. But I think in the moment, you could really see why this camera was, was, was important um, because them just being dazed and it's 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 an interesting thing to see and it's it's very beneficial to have to have that extra eyes. Yeah. And the brain right. that remembers. Right. Everything. Everything that's gone on it's capturing. Yeah. Um, yeah. And and with let's talk a little bit about the the main difference here yeah. uh, between these two models. You kind of touched on it, but elaborate on that more. Listen, they're both amazing cameras. They both um, very high quality HD yeah. recording, 
um, have that cloud connectivity, connect to your phone, Bluetooth, Wi-Fi, the works. I think the main thing is that the Pro has an internal uh, camera uh, that's helpful for people who want a more clear understanding or want an in-cabin uh, experience. Yeah. You see a lot of Uber and Lyft drivers, for example, that, that uh, uh, want that. Um, and, you know, it's to keep them kind of extra safe. Uh, so we have these two options. The first one, uh, the Beam is um, a slightly lower cost. Um, it's more for your everyday user. It's more discreet, right? You can kind of put it behind your rearview mirror and typically forget about it. Um, and, and the Pro is really uh, to have that, that um, extra coverage. Uh, so that one right there that you have is kind right. of the, the external piece. And there's a small camera that connects internally that has infrared right. lights as well, um, which can see at night. Uh, and it's extremely high quality. I think if people go to our website or your website and see videos, like you'd be very happy with the quality. Yeah, and this, so like I said, I've tried the Beam. Um, and, and the way that it, um, like you're saying, it's very discreet. This is so tiny, like smaller than, I, like a credit card, truly. It's, it's that small, maybe the width, but you know, lengthwise, it's, it's definitely smaller, very compact, sits really nicely, uh, like you're saying, behind your rear view mirror. But you can, you can swivel it in the car. So if you need to, for whatever reason, have an internal view, you can do that. Um, the other cool thing is that it's picking up audio as well. Yeah. So you can hear everything too, which is another great, I think, piece of, you know, additional piece of evidence to have. Because um, what's said can be really important as well, just as, as important as what is seen. Absolutely. And uh, the retail price, the difference here, uh, the Pro is $139.95 and the Beam is $119. Did I get that right? Yeah. Um, great. So, um, I mean, Nexar has, well, for, I, I'm curious, I mean, do, like yeah. how, how long did it take Nexar to kind of perfect these two models? Well, we started with the Pro uh, and then mm -hmm. uh, we introduced uh, the Beam. Um, and, and, you know, we're continuing to make more models of cameras. Um, and, you know, when it's a philosophical question, when do you reach perfection? And I guess never. Yeah. Uh, <laughs> but I think, I think what we're really trying to aspire to is a really good app experience. I think these are very high quality cameras uh, and they are enablers and they allow uh, video and telematics event to be streamed uh, to the phone and be captured on the app on the phone. I think the added benefit is, again, within the app and the other cool things that we can do. We have an amazing team um, that works on AI uh, and we're starting more and more to understand what's happening on the road. And we're using that knowledge uh, to let our user base know what's happening on the uh, so we are detecting objects that might um, uh, that, that that might block a lane, for example. Uh, mm -hmm. And so we are using that information to let our users know that a lane is blocked in a certain location. And you know, having eyes on the road and having many people drive on XR cameras really allows us to have a good understanding of what's happening on the road in real time. Mm -hmm. um, and, and that is information that we want to, to provide to our users to you know, get their experience level from where it is now to, to, to much higher. Uh, so we want to share the data that we're starting to understand and gather from the road. Um, and and you know, we want our users to really take advantage of it. Uh, so yeah. I, I, I think the road to our, towards our perfection is, is through getting our app uh, better and getting um, more value uh, to more people. Yeah, so so Nexar has developed the hardware and the software. That's correct. Wow, so no, yeah. no third parties touching the app. It's all done by Nexar, uh, which is amazing. And I know here at Beta, um, you know, we believe that there's nothing worse than having a great, you know, if there's an app integrated product, there's nothing worse than having a wonderful product, but then like the app is just horrible, you know, or is like yeah. draining your battery. Um, oh yeah. 
or is like not user friendly, hard to set up. I mean, this is like so seamless. And I can speak, you know, uh, from my own personal experience setting it up. It was like I did I did nothing really beforehand. I didn't even really I watched a couple of videos, but it was like it's all in the box. Like all the instructions are there. Um, it's so easy to do in and, and just I think under like three minutes. I think you hit a really good point. And I think that is basically the differentiator from our competition. Um, I think our accompanying app is an arm and a leg above the competition. Um, and when you go out there, you buy an app and you see the, you, know, you buy a camera and you see the uh, companion app, it's usually um, made by a third party and kind of laggy. And, and, and we made this in kind of a holistic way where we have the hardware and software in mind. Um, and I, I think that is really what helped us kind of be a market leader in dash cams. Yeah. And it's a camera for any driver, really. Um, I think I was, you know, in the camp of thinking that dash cams were only for drivers of, you know, cab services or ride sharing mm -hmm. services, but really it's great for anyone. It's great for, you know, uh, the mom or dad who's driving their kids to and from soccer practice. Who else would you say is this like really? Uh, Families are a classic, especially yeah. when you you have you have a new driver, you have a new team driver. <laughs> you need to give give away your car. Uh, right. I, I think that's that's they're typically in high risk. Um, and I guess you ask people if they're good drivers, many are going to say, "Yeah, we're good drivers." If you ask other people if the other people are good drivers, they're going to say, "No, they're all bad drivers." Yeah, essentially. Yeah. The unfortunate um, truth is that we are all likely going to be involved in, 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 in a collision eventually. And yeah. uh, it's just great to have that peace of mind out there. Uh, for families, it's exquisite. For As a parent myself, not to teenagers yet, I would like to know uh, where my kids uh, are uh, and if they are in harm's way. I, I would like to know about it immediately. Right. Yeah. Now, um, as we look to the future, Ami, what can we expect to see from Nexar next? Yeah. Um, I mean, we're always continuing to work on the app, right? We always want to give uh, benefits to our driving community, and we're going to come out with new cool features. Uh, but we're also adding new camera models. Uh, we're seeing now that um, a lot of people are requesting kind of remote streaming. Uh, and remote connection to the vehicle. And that's something that we're gonna be implementing real soon. More of a sentry and kind of security uh, mode. Um, and, and yeah, I think that's the way we're going. We're going, you know, in continuing to build uh, really good hardware and accompanying software um, and, and help make the road safer, uh, which is the ultimate goal. Um, so, you know, continue and expanding our community of drivers, giving insights and uh, having more great stuff. Yeah, well, here at Beta, we are proud to partner with Nexar um, and, you know, be a part of that amazing mission. You know, where can people go to learn more about these dash cams? I mean, first of all, if you want to see some cool stuff happening on the road, Nexar in social media, just write Nexar and, 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 <laughs> and you'll see, or caught by Nexar too. Uh, go to our website, uh, getnexar.com, see for yourself what people are saying. Um, look at the app in the app store. Um, check out our reviews on even Amazon. Like they're all extremely high. It's a really high quality product and, and go buy it at beta. Yes, yes. You can purchase both of these products at Beta. Um, the Pro retails for $139.95 and the Beam for $119. Amit, thanks so much for joining me today. Thank you for having me, Noelle. It was a pleasure. <laughs> Always a pleasure, yes. And you guys, thank you all for joining us here on this live episode of Beta Insider. Um, subscribe to our YouTube channel. We're making content all the time. Uh, and we'll see you next time here in the Beta TV studio. Bye.